You're a lying fucking bitch! I'm gonna fucking kill you! Hello, people of the interwebs. I'm Funko. And I'm Bunko, so buckle up, because today we're going to play Knee Deep! Deep. Alrighty, so we're gonna get back into the game. This is the saved game screen. I'm gonna click it and we're gonna go in. Load, Load it. Here we go, change the set! Oh my god, I spit everywhere and I'm so sorry. As the music slowly fades out to nothing. Let's set change! Back to the exact same set we were just at, but alright. <laughs> okay. All right, that guy isn't real. Yes, he is. That guy isn't real. That oh, guy dude, isn't real. Is. <laughs> I thought he was real. That's just a cutout. That is just a cutout, my friend. All right, who do we oh. want to talk to? Talk? Choices. Choices right off the bat. Remy Dixon. Remy you Dixon. You always talk to the man behind the counter first. Remy Dixon. Remy Dixon. Or Jim Larman. Jim Larman. I'm going to go with Remy Dixon. Because he He's looks like a douche, and really girls always go for the douche first, know. remember? You can't put a convenience store close to a supermarket in Indonesia. Give a strange response. Uh, always strange response. We're not gonna ever give you anything you guys want. Just the strange <laughs> responses. Do I look Canadian? Yes? Fair question. Is it? Canadians <laughs> Uh, he's being strange back. Hey, hey, I get that reference. Okay. I don't. What is it? It's from uh, The Princess Bride. Oh, yeah. Have fun storming the castle. That's awesome. That's the best response. All right. Okay, but man, okay. I'm shocked you bit Woodstep's propaganda hook, line, and sinker. Loser didn't hate this place so much when Rutledge Silloway paid his bills. I Was that the guy picketing? Yeah, no. He was picketing the church thing. Right? Yes. Right? I think. And why is Remy talking to him about himself in the third, third person? person? That confused the fuck out of me. Okay, okay. we'll just play this game. Oh. Goodbye! Okay. <laughs> okay. I watched Apollo 11 launch from that tower back when I was your age. You're old. You're old. <laughs> Lend you his binoculars for a better view. Oh! oh shit! She on fire! Oh my god, I'm sorry I'm sitting so Why? much. I can't stop! Why? I'm sorry, okay. Back in the day, my beard was better. Oh! I I think he I think he was trying to burn back. Uh maybe? His beard was better than Lincoln's? Yes. Oh probably. Okay. Sure, the dead man was Kern. Can you confirm that the man hanging from the tower tonight was Tad Kern? Sure looked like him. Had a wallet with his driver's license inside, too. I'm not sure if that was just really serious sarcastic, or, like, he was just trying to say it like that. I don't know. Because it's like, sure looked like him. Had like, his wallet with his driver's license inside, her too. I mean, this is like, me. But it, someone could have planted that. You don't know. I guess. I don't know. Uh... Was he on his own? Was Kern alone? Nope, he was here with some folks from the Red Eclipse movie studio. Location filming, I think. Messy death? Uh, was the death scene a pain to clean up? <laughs> Are you saying he had to clean it up? I think he did, because this is where the... But yeah. I... I would think it'd be like a forensics team that has to clean it up, not like, no. hey, hey, janitor, go clean this shit up back there. <laughs> Got another one. Remy says you need to go clean up that shit back there, Remy does. Say, Remy. <laughs> Remy, you're a dick. Hey, it could have been worse. At least he didn't jump for Christ's shotgun. True. Yeah, it could have been Kurt Cobain. Oh, shots fired, <laughs> literally. <laughs> okay. Why is suicide? Any idea why Kern killed himself? Probably because he's an actor and all actors are secretly depressed. Oh, that's just sad. I'm yeah, an actor. His <laughs> oh, oh, that was definitely damn. a burn. That Shit. was a burn. He's already dead. You don't need to burn him while he's yeah. in, like, hell. Kick him while he's down. Okay. Shit. And he's screaming? Did Kern scream at the last second? Like, maybe he changed his mind? Probably not, son. Pro probably not. That's a morbid question. Or no, just... he didn't scream. Not that I heard. Okay. Where are these people? These studio peoples? Where are all the studio peoples? Are the Red Eclipse folks still here? Crap. 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 Yeah, I think so. Last I saw, they were hanging out at Hungry Chiefs. 
We're running out of space. Uh, I know, I know, I know. Alrighty, well, sorry about that. It took us a little bit longer to get the recording started, so, uh, yeah, we changed shirts. It it took it, a while. Like I said, it took a while. <laughs> anyway, anyway, so back into the game. All right, let's see here. Um, I'm a little hungry. Strange place to mourn. Really? They're just sitting around some dusty, greasy spoon? Oh, oh shit. You don't know what that place is? Have you been there, girl? It's she like really there. good. It's got the red letter dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> let's see. Hey, some people drown their sorrows in a bottle of beer. Others gorge on scout burgers and super size soup. That actually, Fat people! That actually sounds pretty good. Yeah. Uh, ooh, a scout burger? I'll take one. Anyway. Those people should count their blessings and their calories. <laughs> oh, oh, shit! Damn. That wasn't even strange. That was just a damn burn. Yeah, they, some of these are like strange, and then it's like uh, they're just really, really mean or like violent. <laughs> What does he have to say to that? I don't know. I'm kind of curious. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Okay. <laughs> just walk away on that. Uh, not bad, I guess. And count their calories. I to the blog before Lenny pops an aneurysm. Okay. All right. Pops an aneurysm. Pops an aneurysm. Pop. I thought it was has an aneurysm. Or pops a blood vessel or something. I guess. That... Pop. It just sounds like he's popping something, like popping a pill. <laughs> popping an aneurysm. Okay. <laughs> popping aneurysms. <laughs> It's, you know, like popping pills it's the new from drug. the other, you know, the, the, like, yeah, anyway. Okay. Uh, it's loading. Uh, okay, anyway. Kern's companion. Choose a fact. Kern's ID. Kern's companions. Kern's companions. Told that the actor Kern was staying at Chief Roadsides with a crew from the studio working on his next movie. Inflammatory. The last movie on Tag Kern's filmography may never lend. Soares closes at the door. It so, remains to be seen whether suicide leaves the movie just as a fatality to be hanged. That makes it more about the movie. Yeah. Edgy. It's been his final days in the CD's terrorist trap called Chief Roadside's Wonderland, but it seems that although he was among friends, he felt utterly alone, so desperate it seems that he took his own life. That is edgy. That is definitely edgy. Making a lot of jumping to conclusions. Was well, cautious. He died. The janitor confirmed that he died. It's just safe. Um, <laughs> do we... I like edgy. I like this. It explains, I feel like, more. Yeah, we'll go with that. May upset Kern's friends. No, oh, whatever. Whatever. Enter Hungry Chiefs. We're about to go talk to his friends. Those, Those fat fucks. <laughs> <laughs> you fat fucks. Are you one of Kern's friends? If you are here, Mr. Oh, you're Eager, not that fat. I guess it's safe to assume you're not But you are smoking, so you're probably dying inside. Sorry, I talked to that guy talking. I just wanted to point that out. Some website. There's an app for that. I've still got my smartphone. Do you Ooh, she could blog right here, right now. Right now. It's good to have skills to fall back on. But look, you do right by us this time. Maybe we can help you. Are you trying to bribe me? Are you trying to bribe me? It'll work. <laughs> the new website's still optimized for Netscape, isn't it? The spinny flaming skulls are a nice touch. I think I think that was a burn. Uh, okay. I, I think. I've always been curious, Miss T. Why'd you pick Phaedra as your screen? It sounded, it sounded cool. cool. I thought it had a nice ring to it. I see. Good to know. Why else would I choose it? Kern hungry? Let's get some of those deets. Did Kern eat everything on his plate? Did he order dessert? Where did that what, would that How would, did that question lead up to this? She just she got to know him and now she's trying to get the details, see if he was depressed or not. I guess. Weird question. See, he even thinks uh, it's he weird. He didn't have much of an appetite. Little dude, little hunger. Anyway, I was curious about something. Or maybe he was on drugs. Or maybe he was depressed about that his movies suck. That too. But that's the sad answer. I like the fact. I like to think he was on drugs. Okay. <laughs> hmm? Saw your post. Might have cut close to the bone for some of us. Tina, especially. Have a heart, lady. Strange response. Strange response! Always a pleasure, Donnie. Can I call you Donnie? Or Fred? Was okay. that actually his name? No. Okay. <laughs> It says his name in the thing. I don't know what his name was. I wasn't paying attention. I'm not talking to 
said Tina. I'm talking to Remy. Remy! Remy, bet you didn't know all Spanish moss comes from one ancient dude's beard. He chased a girl up a tree. Now that's a strange response. Um, or a strange intro. Intro to a conversation. Or you need to just say hello. Yeah. And you Hi. Just... Uh, freaky beard. That's either one big beard or one big dude. No wonder she ran away. Chew. He probably tripped on her trying to catch her. Oh, oh. Remy would have used a good. This is Remy from the gas station. Yeah. It talks in the third person. For some reason, I thought he was talking about <laughs> somebody else. Damn it, Remy, you're confusing me. No, he's Remy. Okay. Would Remy see? Would Remy see? You saw Why do you work gas, everywhere? You? you work at a gas station too. It's a play. You know, he has to. I know. I know that's how it works <laughs> in a play, but I just, I was wondering in my head, I was like, why would they have the same guy working in both restaurants? Because it's a play. I guess. Sure did. Served him a scout burger special. Fresh meat and everything. He ate like a hungry raccoon. Hungry raccoon. So a lot? That the other guy said he didn't eat very much. Yeah, I know. Did Kern seem upset? Depressed? Angry? Remy might have made him a little mad. Told him how awful Meacham was. Ooh. Ooh. He insulted the man's work. That's not very nice, Remy. Does the menu offer vegan options? Why do we have to ask that? Why? <laughs> no, man. Just me. That's... Are you vegan? Are you vegan? Probably. She is a blogger. I guess. She's... Is that a requirement? You can tell me. Is that a requirement to be a blogger? Do you have to be vegan? I mean, if you want to be a good one. I mean, I have nothing against vegans or anything, but... but I do have something against bloggers. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fuck you, bloggers. <laughs> Fuck you. No, no, I love you, blog. Oh, they're gone. Shit. They're already blogging about us. Oh, awesome. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's cool. That's cool. I like meat chunks in my yogurt. Okay. That wasn't even the strange response. <laughs> She's just a strange person. All right, I guess. Go. Whatever. Tasty. Oh, by the way, Lenny heard Cordray talking about you. He wanted to work. Is that Cordray? Is is that Cordray over there that I already talked to? What happened to like half of my body? We're fine. I can't believe this is happening. Delve into sex. Delve life. straight into the sex life. What's it like? Being with a guy who's so tiny. Oh! Did he keep falling off? Did that make him sad? Oh my god! Oh my god! Man is dead! Damn! Shit! I didn't even. I never thought it would get that serious so fast! Jesus! I thought this would be a joke. I didn't. Oh! Well, now we're an asshole. We weren't physical. Not lately. He said he wanted some space to maximize his opto levels. Okay. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna go. Why? Su I, why I suicide? don't know how to. Why suicide? Yeah. Why Kern want to kill himself? That's the thing. He wasn't depressed or anything. He really liked where the new project was going. And since you're here. What, what about me? Are you, are you gonna just gonna get mad at me? I'm sorry about the sex life thing. I didn't know that's where that was going. <laughs> yes. What right do you have to say Tag was all alone? That no one tried to save him? I loved him. He didn't need saving. This is all wrong. Don't click the enjoy single life. That'll be enjoy the single. Life. Gotcha. Oh my god. Just no, do give a strange response. response. Pineapple. Okay. I mean, yes. That's better. There we go. That's better. Definitely straight. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh Jesus. Holy shit. Pineapple walks away. Pineapple. I'm going to use that one. It's such a tragedy. There's the guy. What happened to your mother? You deserve better. M my mother? What? Uh, what's the connection? Um, what? It must Who's be, my mom? He must be. What do you know about her? A private investigator named Casey Gaddis exposed an affair between her and a good friend of mine. He must be talking hey. about something that's happened before. I guess. I've read the article. This is the first episode. So it shouldn't. I don't know. Anyway. No, that's. You. Like, it's foreshadowing it's stuff. Hired him to investigate Kern's death. Really? They don't, have, some to coincidence. they don't have to explain everything. That seems awfully convenient. That does. Some might call it fake. 
an opportunity to set things right. Justice delayed is still justice. Tell me about Kern! Give me what any of these. about Kern? I can tell you that he held a ranking of dark matter. Oh, you're the a crazy guy from the church. Those in the church yes. Of us. Church size? How big is the church of us? How big is it? Oh! It's like six people. Wow. We've got six million oh, members. Oh, damn! Worldwide. Shit, Last that's count. not bad. Growing every day. Such a pleasing sight. Well, they're gonna take over America. I'm pleased, at the very least. But you show some aptitude for the ways of the church. I'm out. Skeptical, boy. Skeptical. It's interesting and all, but I'm not sure I buy it. I don't buy it at all, I'm actually. Not. Little skepticism is healthy. Mr. What the f- wasn't Did you hear the way he said healthy? Healthy. He's like, healthy. <laughs> healthy. <laughs> so now we know that Mr. Kern was in the church. I, yeah. Did you make him kill? Did you kill him? Over. We let him join the church on a trial basis for a few months. He landed a big movie deal. Training seemed to work for him. I Luck. guess. Or maybe he was lucky. Alrighty. Well, we roasted everyone in there. <laughs> burned, burned, burned. Okay. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of conflicting Miller, stories. The movie director claimed Kern was depressed. Mm -hmm. Tina Gray thought Kern seemed happy. Remy seemed mostly neutral, except when it came to Meacham. I know some people said he didn't eat at all. Some people said he ate a lot. And then some people say that he just got angry when any time you mentioned his movies. Well, I know this was about to mention. Miller didn't See. think Kern had an appetite, but Remy described a pretty big last meal. I was meal. about to say, he was like, he ate like a hungry raccoon, which I assumed is a lot. But then the other guy was like, he didn't eat at all. Hmm. Mm. And what's the deal with creepy Gordon Cordray? He is very creepy. How does he know my mama? I'd have to call her about him. Surprise! First call home in a couple of years. Okay. You gotta roast everyone, even your own mother. Okay, okay uh, now we get to choose. Um, don't do it about... Don't... Let's... Do it about the relationship. We've already gone this far. <laughs> <laughs> edgy, what does Edgy one say? In the days leading up to his death, actor Tag Kern closed himself off from those dears to him. Tina Gray, a red clip... Red Eclipse Studios employee and girlfriend of Kern blamed Church of Us doctrine for his distance. He was taking a break to maximize his optomolecule levels, she said. That is... That, like, this is the church more than anything. Yeah, yeah. inflammatory. Driven by his lust for power in the model of the Church of Us. <laughs> God damn. Tag Kern refused sex to girlfriend Tina Gray. Damn. Holy shit. <laughs> oh... If you guys notice the camera cut out there, sorry about that. I'm going to have to make a cut here. Sorry. Are you sure we want to write the report over this? I don't know. I kind of want to. I, you want to do the inflammatory one? It's going to create a lot of drama, and I that's mean, what this is about. It's a drama. Oh, this is a play. Do it. it. Report. 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 Major clickbait. True. I I don't know. <laughs> Stop poking that tiger in its cage, kitty. The church will shut us down. What? I don't give a shit about the church. <laughs> Two days. days later. Here we go. She walks for two days straight. Just... Oh, looks like we're going back to the interrogation room. Tell us about this source of yours. The one who calls himself Anonymous. Hey, I was right. I pronounced it right. Anonymous. <laughs> uh... Just a stranger, I guess. We don't uh, really know yet. Yeah, just a stranger. He texted me out of the blue. I know you find people better than I know a non-mouse. True. Do you realize how much trouble you've caused? I mean, I did slay everyone in that diner. I know. It was... <laughs> <laughs> you hear any burns? Just fuck you. And I'm not done yet. Oh, oh no. I'm the burns are just getting started. Don't worry. Oh, oh, we're someone else now. Sweet. Death investigation. Uh, is this Lenny? <laughs> what? <laughs> is this is this the guy, her boss? Maybe. I'm not sure. Is his name Lenny? The guy, her boss. 
Yeah, I think so. Okay, anyway. Uh, maybe bringing the kid was wrong. Another bit of news. My night with Reggie. I'm going to go maybe bring the kid Normally, was wrong. I'd never bring Reggie to a scene with a dead body. Oh, no, I think this my is the sheriff. Him, yeah. And I'm a reporter. This is my job. Oh, he's a reporter. Never mind. Just hope the ex-wife doesn't get wind of it. I also hope it doesn't scar him. You brought your kid along? Is that what happened? I guess. Is that man really dead, Daddy? He brought his freaking kid with him. Yeah, you don't really want your ex-wife to find out about that. <laughs> hey, you know, whenever I had my son for my weekend, yeah, I took him to see a dead body. <laughs> I guess you know why we got a divorce. <laughs> He's scarred for life. <laughs> well, be honest with the boy. I'll pay for the shrink. <laughs> be honest, let's fuck him up. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. Just I... fuck it. Yeah. Stay here while I talk to Ozzy. Okay. He did. Okay. But then I see he's fine. You <laughs> see, he don't give a fuck. He's just. <laughs> is that yeah, guy really so... dead? Yeah. Yeah. He's he's dead. Okay, but can we get ice cream? See, <laughs> this is what kids worry about. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, I'll get you ice cream. Evening, Jack. What Evening. the fuck was that? Evening, Jack. What's the story? Evening, Jack. Hey, Ozzy, tell me the news. Okay. Mr. Swayhill here tried to bore a hole in his engine block with a 22 caliber pistol. Ricochet right through the left eye. Is he stupid? Go I like his voice. <laughs> no, not that guy. The guy who shot himself. Yeah, I know. Well, no, I like his voice, though. Oh, yeah. Go snarky. Guess that idea was a non-starter. Oh, the burns! Oh. This guy got the burns, too! Shit! <laughs> All right. Hey, hang on to that day job a little while longer, Jack. Oh, no, come on. That was a good burn. That was a good burn. He just doesn't appreciate that. Okay, one more. Anything else? About Sway Hill, no, but I was curious. What brought you back uh -oh. to Cypress Knee? I figured you'd be important all choice. Bigger things. Okay, um, oh. mm. I don't know who that lady is, but her textures are freaking the fuck out. Very true. She just She's changed blonde, it blonde, black, blonde, black, blonde, black. <laughs> uh, I like this gig. I, I think he likes being a. I guess he likes it. I mean, I guess if he's closer to his son, or did he bring his son somewhere else? Or does his son live here? I don't know. I think he brought his son to here. Uh, I like this gig. I like writing for the notice. But no one's getting rich in the newspaper business these days. True. True. I think we made a good choice. <laughs> I got really loud for a second. That scared me. <laughs> Sounds like we got another dangler at Chief Roadsides. Someone famous. Might be Bieber. Oh, oh, oh damn. We Even the checking. game is burning people. Shit. This burns all over the place today. <laughs> God. Jackson Lawrence Bellet, you brought us oh. That's oh. our ex wife. Oh. I see why you left her. I'd probably have a seizure if I stayed with that woman. <laughs> what are you? Did you notice my hair is different? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's always different. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, this is important. Mm, stay calm. Stay calm. Stay calm. Tamara, I just stopped by to ask Ozzy a couple of questions. Reggie's staying back. He can't see anything. But I did tell him that he's dead. So, I mean... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I want to be able to trust you, Jack. But you're so irresponsible. I'm a recovering addict? Am I? Yes. You're recovering at it. You're you're you know recovering. what? You know what? I'm gonna be honest about my problem. I'm in the program. Meetings twice a week when I can. See, we're doing fine. Irresponsible, lazy journalist, addict. You're not really fit to be a father, Jack. Look who's fucking talking. I, I don't know. <laughs> I would be belligerent about it, but I think you're right. I'm. He's trying. He's trying. He's doing twice a week. He is trying. Nobody's perfect, Tam. I do my best. He's got a really deep voice, though. I see why you're nice. attracted to it. Mm, the judge always loves to hear that one. Ah, this bitch. You know what? Sure, Tam. Let's go see the judge. I'm sure we can find plenty to talk about on both sides. Yeah, how you like that? That's the first time I was mean to you, and I agree with it. You pushed me what too far. Ever, Jack. You've turned into... Such a disappointment. I keep hoping you'll turn it around. Maybe not for me, but for your son. What a bitch. 
You're a lying fucking bitch! I'm gonna fucking kill you! Oh, oh, oh. Let's go to that other story. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Speaking of Reggie, I've got to check out this other dead body call over at Chief Roadside. I'm gonna take my son to see two dead bodies in one day! Two for one. And I also promised him ice cream, so I'm gonna get that on the way. <laughs> on the way. Night with him. I've got clients here looking at mobile home rental options. Okay, mobile home rental options. Yes, you're so much better than me. Selling meth trailers. Good job. Good job. At least he's a fucking reporter. Clients can cope. Get over it. I'm sure they won't mind Reggie tagging along. He's a kid. They're going to be like, oh, is this neighborhood good for kids? I mean, if you want to sell meth to them. Exactly. <laughs> You, you, you just you just said you didn't want him around this stuff. This is my job. That's your job. You want him around selling you want him around selling trailers? Or you want him around with fucking dead bodies? Boy. <laughs> Boy. Always. Always. That never changes. This bitch. All right, we're walking through grass. All right. Walks right off the stage. And scene change. Whoa! Chief Roadside's Wonderland suffers from a double-edged fact. It is and isn't what it used to be. That is some deep shit, man. Lost in time. <laughs> deep shit. The Silloway family built this place in the 1960s. Back then... White folks really didn't think twice about whether they offended other cultures. That's true. True. Now, the Wonderland's an appalling relic. Most motorists zoom right by, never giving a second look. Guess. I don't really know why. It's not like it's... It's not super offensive. I don't feel like it's offensive. I don't know. Anyway. uh, Reason to stop. That's not a reason to stop. I don't know. If you're going bankrupt, I feel like it's a reason to stop. It's not a freak show. No. I, these are all bad options. I, Just pick one. They've landed on freak show. Of course, all it takes is one suicidal Hollywood has-been to wake up this tacky little tourist trap. That would inspire some interest. True. Someone died here. There's no other option. <laughs> so we're talking to this guy over here. Give me your money. Oh. Some people don't give a possum's pecker whether Tag Kern's alive or dead. We got bigger problems. I like I like the possum's pecker. <laughs> I like that. Uh, do we act professional? Be friendly or give a belit? He doesn't. Be friendly. Be friendly. He isn't. He's not being mean. He's just like no one cares. Hey, Mr. Gallon. What's got you all riled up? Mr. Gallon, that's nice. Nice. They're pumping natural gas from below Cypress Swamp for a big development project. They want to run a pipeline through my house. That takes permits, though. Yeah, they can't just... They can't just knock your house down. <laughs> they have to at least pay you for it. Developers can't do that without permits. Some people know how to work their way around that process. Powerful people. Anyways. But they at least have to pay. Anyway. They, they have to pay you Look, money. thanks for your time, but I really should talk to someone about Kern. Don't be an irresponsible jackass. Mm. I can point you to proof of government malfeasance right here at Chief Roadside. All right, All right. You know what? You got me. Tell me. All right, Mr. Gallon. What's the proof? Go see who's parked outside the Mohawk Inn. It'll be interesting. I guarantee it. Why oh, you gotta shit. be cryptic? Why don't you just fucking tell me? No, no, we gotta go look. No, no, it's gotta, go look. It's gotta be a surprise. <laughs> you know, that, that hotel is right over there that I could totally just point to and tell you about? Whatever. Go look. Oh. I'll humor you this one time. Let's see who it is. I better be fucking surprised. I better be like, what? Holy shit, it's Darth Vader? I don't know. <laughs> Fucking Darth Vader. <laughs> I did it. I killed In the parking lot of the Mohawk Inn, you spy an official town car from Cypress Knee. It's the mayor. Hmm. That is quite suspicious. Closer inspection suggests 
It's the town car assigned to Gary Buckingham, chairman of the Cypress Knee Council. That is curious. I guess Gallon was right. Time to find a wayward town official at the motel. Knock on all the doors! Or the one that the car's parked in front of. Yeah. <laughs> God. Take the call, be a man. Evening, Tamara. I don't have time to fight right now. Way to answer. No, 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 no. She is, though. She is, She though. is, though. Let's be... She is, though. But do I want to be angry about it, or do I want to defuse the situation? Okay, apologize. Try to defuse it, and then... Well, let's be clear. She, she is. is calling to fight. Hey, my bad. Go ahead. I'm taking Reggie to the lodge before we go to the Founders Day Festival. Ice Remember cream. ice cream. Ice cream. I promised him. I promised him ice cream. you got to get him ice cream, please. I... Kinda promised he could have ice cream too. Yes, Jack, I know. It's all he talks about. Thanks for that. You're welcome. Gotcha. Make Raise the kid, it our son. Make the kid a little bit happy. You don't have to take all the fun out of life. Damn, fuck our kid. And he's like sitting right, right there. Great chatting <laughs> with you as always. Okay, can we Let's just go listen to the motel window. Really dark. Gallant property is an obstacle. Eminent domain's a tough nut to crack on this project. You mean people don't want their houses bulldozed for bullshit? No, it's a pipeline. It's for the community. Fuck you. <laughs> That's their idea of pillow talk. Hot. Nice. Tough, maybe. There's so many Not burns. Right? So many burns. <laughs> it's possible. Expensive, though. We're not just fudging dates on a permit here. Snap a photo. Turn, turn, turn the sound Turn the sound off. <laughs> that ought to go nicely with a front page article. Then I go knock. We don't need housekeeping, Jim. It's who's it. who's Jim? <laughs> it's Jack Billet from the notice, Mr. Chairman. I know there was a woman in here. Where's the woman? I heard. I heard. Come on okay. in. Okay. <laughs> huh? Well. Well, we already have the photo. Come in, then. Now we can prove it. What you don't hear that? Chief Roadsides, Jack. You just fuck it with me. What the fuck is that? <laughs> uh, wondered that Great about question. you. Not much of a hangout for locals, usually. Fancy seeing you here, and you. Oh, no. I I'm here alone. Oh, she's trying to open the window. Okay. That's not I what I like, thought was happening at all. It's like, uh, what, what is happening? Two people were talking in here, man and woman. The senses play tricks out here by the highway. You're stupid. You're st I can hear her making sounds right now. She's hiding. I bet she's in the bathroom. Windows jammed, Gary. Well, you just well, blew everything shit. now. It's not what it looks like. <laughs> it's not what it looks like. Jesus Christ, dude, calm down. It's not what it looks like. Looks like the town council chairman and the chief planning officer skulking around a sleazy motel. That is what it looks like, I guess. Well, it's not yeah. really a sleazy motel. It's pretty nice at motel, if you ask me. No, you see the stains on the wall? I guess. Stains. It's not that bad. Stains. The bathroom looks pretty clean. That is a nice bathroom. That is a nice bathroom. Okay, so it is what it looks like. It got so sad. <laughs> oh, okay, it <laughs> is what it looks like. You're hatching some scheme to get the gallant land through eminent domain. True. Yes. Fine. It is what you think. But you can't prove it with circumcised evidence. Yes. Uh, I got that picture, though. I think you mean... I was about to say, I'm pretty sure circumcised, circumcised is the wrong and the wrong word for that. I was like, is he trying to make no, a pun? If I meant taking the long way round, I'd say that. What? What? Okay. Oh, I think that's circumlocution. Yes. Yes. It's got nothing to do with putting anybody in the electric chair. Anyway, Jack, how's the wife and kid? Well, family's falling apart. Well, it... Oh, you are really stupid. <laughs> Divorce is finalized. 
Tamara wants full custody of Reggie. So, you know, just great. Yeah. Life's peachy. Oh. Anyway, oh, shit. can we all agree this isn't newsworthy? Uh, it is newsworthy. It is. Solid evidence or it's newsworthy? I don't know what he means by, like, he has solid evidence. Yes. Because we took the photo. Keep in mind, there we I've go. got a photo of you two in this room together. That's enough to raise questions among the voters. There yes. Go. Boom, walk out on that note. Boom! All right, I think we're going to I think we're going to end it here for now. Evening, Jack. You tell me with the rest of the sharks, huh? Yes, but that's going to be it for this episode. We've been recording for about 35 minutes now. We kind of want to keep this about 30, 35 minutes to each episode, because otherwise, if we went 15 minutes, 20 minutes for every episode, we'd be playing this game for forever. Yeah, but really if you guys want us to go a little bit longer in every episode, just let us know, because we don't mind recording this a little bit longer, because we understand that sometimes we're cutting up the story, and we don't want it to seem weird. Yeah, we like to actually make progress in the story. Like if if I did, if I knew this wasn't going to be much longer, I'd probably go to the next scene change. But I don't know how much he. It looks like he's going to go here, from the room to here, and then he's going to talk to this guy. Then he's going to go to the bus, talk to the church guy, and then maybe they'll change scenes. But I don't want to speculate and it go on for like an hour. But anyway, uh, so this game's turned out to be really good. There's a lot of burns in this episode. The so, burns. So uh, yeah, so this is this is. Oh, I love this game. This is awesome. But anyway, thank you guys for watching, and as always, if you liked this video, leave, leave a like, like down, down below. below. If you like to comment, leave, leave a comment down, down below. below. If you want to subscribe, do that thing. Otherwise, we'll see you all next time. Yeah! So the question, ma'am. <laughs> Give a straight <laughs> response. <laughs> what does that do? What is it? I, you know, you know, next time, next time someone asks me a question about how something's working out or something, I go, couldn't stab a frog with it.